Hello, my name is Pam Powers Hanley, and I'm the social media editor for the American Journal of Medicine. I'm here today with our editor in chief, Dr. Joseph Albert, and we're talking about an article that's coming up in the journal on training and its effect on arterial stiffness. This is a very interesting article. It's from Vilnius University in Lithuania. And what they did in this study was they took patients with metabolic syndrome, that is abnormal lipids and obesity and high uh, inflammatory markers, in other words, people who are very high risk for atherosclerosis, and they put them through an exercise training program, uh, and they were able to demonstrate that this decreased their arterial stiffness measurements. Now, arterial stiffness correlates with an increased risk for the development of cardiovascular disease. So it was clear that this exercise program decreased the risk for these patients to have atherosclerotic events such as heart attacks and stroke. Clearly, exercise is important uh, as a part of one's daily activities. Thank you, Dr. Albert. Could you tell us more about what the take-home message for physicians would be regarding this article? The take-home message for physicians is that we all need to be encouraging our patients to do exercise. This doesn't mean that they have to join fitness clubs and lift 200 pound weights. It means that they should do some aerobic activity every day for 30 to 40 minutes. That's the standard recommendation of the American Sports Associations. It's also the standard recommendation of the American Heart Association. So please encourage your patients to daily do some form of exercise. I always tell my patients my motto is only exercise on the days that you eat. <laughs>